Guys, both of you uh, just, you know, last weekend wasn't the way you guys scripted it, but now you get back in the win column. What's it like to have two in a row? Well, I mean, like I mentioned other night, you can never take winning for granted, you know. And I feel like these two games just really show how hard we work Monday through Wednesday to prepare for this weekend. Right. Uh, just to pick off what Moss was saying, you know, we playing like our backs are against the wall, and we know what we got to do to uh, get to what we want, and we want to make it to the tournament, and we want to go to the NCAA tournament, and that's what we playing for. You guys were able to get out to an 11 nothing lead there in the first half. Um, what do you think was the uh, what led to that? Was it did you guys uh, did they not match your intensity or like well, how oh. you guys able to build that 11 nothing lead? So uh, just came out with a lot of fire, you know, defense. We predicate in everything off defense now. Don't even worry about anything else. It's just, you know, guard the ball, do what you got to do defensively, and we all know the offense will come. Well, Did you? Go ahead. Uh, what was it like playing against um, Eslick? I'm probably saying his name wrong. He averaged, what, 30 points last weekend. Um, I mean, he's pretty good. How did you guys feel playing against him? I'm going to let the boss man handle that. I was going to say, Moss was on him. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah you were. <laughs> I mean, he's a great player, and mm -hmm. me personally, I take things personal mm -hmm. when they tell me that I'm guarding other team's best player. So I feel like when I'm challenged, I rise to the occasion to step up to it. Was there anything different done these last two games? You guys only gave up seven three-pointers in two games, and you know, coaches said the weakness of this team has been you know, defending the three at times. Uh, definitely. Uh, just throughout this whole week, throughout practice, we've been working on guarding the three-point line. Just real hard and just getting better at it, and it's now now it's showing. Is there a better understanding, or or, or is it just the opponent, or or, or how you guys? Yeah, it's, I think it's a a mental thing. I think that you know the more we work at it, the better we become, and just having more urgency just to take people off the line and just guard the ball. I think we're doing a better job with that. Does that help you get in transition a little bit easier? That's, yeah, because you know you got, you got long rebounds coming, whether they're short. And you know, we play a lot of four guards, sometimes even five. So we just, we're going to guard the ball, and then we're going to box our man, rebound, and we're going to run. Uh, how, how were you guys able to get to the free throw line so much tonight? How many things that you guys had 32 attempts as a team? I mean, we were just being aggressive, you know. When the lane opens up, not only do you get fouls, but it also creates open shots, and that's a big part of our offense. So we just stick into our offensive principles, and it's paying off for us. You guys are now in first in the West. Do you guys pay attention to the standings at all? And if so, do you want to kind of keep that spot going into uh, February? Uh, to be honest, we're not worrying about it. Uh, we focus on us, us as a team. We were trying, just trying to get better as a team. That's what we're concerned about. Looks Moss, like you look at the stats ever, the standings? No, nah, not really. I don't really uh, keep up with other teams in the OVC until uh, their name pop up on the schedule. For right now, it's all about Murray State and getting better on Monday. Speaking of your defense again, uh, Murray State here says that you guys had an 18-6 to 6 advantage in points off turnovers. So apparently not only were you aggressive on offense, but also aggressive on defense. Would that be an accurate statement? I feel like it is, you know. Uh, today, well, this past week, you know, we turned it up and it all reversed back to practice, you know. We've been getting after each other, making each other better, and it translated to the game.